I need to ask you one thing. What is authenticity? Because it's like, it's kind of easy question. You can say, authenticity means being yourself. But what exactly is being yourself? What is exactly being someone who you are here? Because, like you see, today you have like fitness influencers, some of like uh, cartoon characters, video characters, or like film har characters. Like people still want to be like them, which isn't authentic. So what authenticity really means? Before I answer that question, I will tell you my story. So it's 2022 and I'm after a breakup. I broke up with my girlfriend, ex-girlfriend. And it changes me a lot because I discovered self-improvement. And also I started feeling weird around people. I started being more mean aggressive, rude. It was something like self-defense and something like when you see people are heartbroken, I was just like kind of mean to people because of that. After a couple of months, I downloaded uh, TikTok and I st started like scrolling. In that time, it was like this Sigma content very popular and because of that I I like wanted this content content I like that content because in my head it creates like these people most of are lonely they are kind of sad they have like depression of something and they're just alone you no know? and I feel, I felt same. I even started acting like Tommy Shelby from Peaky Blinders because I liked, like, I loved that that movie, that series, so much that I wanted to to be like Tommy Shelby. And I even started doing that, like, literally, I, I started. Having that in mind, like I start copying, com copied his things, which also kind of helped me because it started with body language, how to how to think and how to like do things properly. But also it was kind of bad for me. Of course, it had bad things, but like I said, it was mostly it it has good things, but mostly it has like bad things. I started being more mean, rude, aggressive towards people, and sometimes I feel like I hate people. I felt that doing degenerate things and when I realized that I uninstall uh, TikTok it was it was easy because it wasn't so like addicted to me for that moment but still I had that in mind that you know this cold hearted this like Sigma type things And in one moment, I was aware that this isn't me. Now we can't we can know what is authenticity. Authenticity and being authentic means that you know your good and bad sides. Which is, for example, your good sides can be gym, playing chess, being good with something. 
also means your habits. Because look at people, for example. Today, being average, like average is still playing video games. When you are not like or talking about video games or playing video games, it's something authentic. It's something that isn't average. If you sleep properly, eat properly, and uh, going to the gym, it is authentic. And like bad, bad sides are most of your fears. Of course, for example, you can be feared of height, spiders, or like climbing, or you know this this sort of things, and. It's authentic because, of course, you you can. So it's something like, for example, arachnophobia. It's kind of average, but in that situation, when you when you are afraid of spiders, but still you can, for example, have you can, for example, have a spider on your like arm going like very slowly. You're you're feeling like scared, but still you're doing it. It signs that you're brave and you're authentic, because even you are scared of that. You are doing something about that. Today, being scared and not doing something about this is average. Exactly. When I say about intensity and average. The bad, like uh, opposite of being authentic, is being average. Today, average is to eat junk food, play video games, jerk off, going to the parties, and having that hedonistic mind that pleasure is everything that you want. It is average. It is something that you know all of all of people. Will want. All of people will think. For example, someone who is afraid of losing is average. Today, most of the people are very, very scared of losing. They are not taking risk. Being authentic means that, for example. Even you're scared of that. You taking that risk. You know that it it can be bad for you, but still you're doing it. Like I said, it's it's like bad sides of like knowing, knowing, knowing your act, knowing your true self. If you think that, for example. If you you know your own spheres, and you can act brave, and for example you you're feared of height, and you say to your friend that you are not afraid of height, you're going to climbing, look at down, and you're scared. This is the worst thing when someone see you. Because you say to your friend, to that person, that you are not afraid, or you you can do something that you can't do. You will instantly, instantly lose that friend because, bro. It's like you just liked them to be like someone who to be someone who you aren't. You know, you know now what is authenticity, what is an authenticity, authenticity. Sorry for my English. And what can I say more? Check this subscribe button down there with post notification button. Check this subscribe and post notification button down there. Take care, and see ya.